Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Lennis 2 on the Mysterious JG. Let's, um... Let's avoid peace for a little while so that we can actually see one or two of the anim enemies here. Just to run away from them, of course. Oh, that, that guy unscrewed from the floor. I'm pretty devastating. Now, here we go. This is what I wanted to see. Oh, yes, yeah, it's just, just one treasure chest, as I suspected. Heavy armor. I wonder if that will turn out to be better than the Giga armor. Giga armor made us, or great armor. Giga armor made us be like really expensive armor. But it doesn't look like it will be better. Hey, it's sensors, aka clown bots. Sensors summon enemies, which makes sense if you think about it. They hit that thing just a little bit harder. Well, never mind. This is the one that summoned the enemy. I wonder how many enemies it can summon. So we'll take out the auto soldier first and, and give it another chance to summon some shit. Oh, it summons other sensors. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, cool. She's got like. It can hit different targets. It's like. It's a friendly version of that attack that those martial art looking dudes would use in Paladin's Quest where they kind of threw their fists out a lot and it would hit different members of your party. Those were really good ones to reflect back of the enemy too. <coughs> Ow, gee. It's getting really loud. Sorry. I don't know how loud it is for you guys, but it was very loud for me. I got a flight door. That's not really that useful. But it reminds me that the bo didn't the boss drop a usable item that I should grab out of the tool bag? So maybe you're looking for this musical instrument. Yeah, whatever. I don't understand this musical instrument quest thing at all. Any anyway, rate, a sage ring. It'll be up here somewhere. Unique shovel. This isn't a hidden treasure. It's just a piece of junk. Yeah, bromide. We should. We can sell, and I didn't bother because we didn't need the money. And it's like the idea of collecting all this random junk. This is what we wanted. Give that to Ferris. Yeah, it might have been better to give it to Nikita. But I don't know for sure that we're going to keep around for the whole game. Let's get back out of here. Have a little chat with you, lady. First of all, let's use, use some magic medicine to get everyone back to feeling fantastic. Excellent. Because you'll refill our medicine bottles, won't you? Yeah, baby. All right. Well, we're back on it. Thanks for the tip at uh, the top off, lady. We're gonna get back to work now. Boo -dee, boo, boo -dee. Yeah. All right. We are wandering around, but there's no... Ah, I keep messing it up. We keep messing up. I really messed that up.
Enemies have regained their strength. What is the deal with these ancient machines? Is this something that was going to get explained? Paladin's Quest did a good job of making this stuff really mysterious and interesting, but it never really did explain. I mean, you kind of sort of are under the impression that the Rigans had built this, like, kind of super base, but you never really found out exactly who the Rigans are. I wonder if we'll get an answer to that in this game. Maybe they answer things so succinctly and so well that uh, it will make sense that there was never a third game in the series. I think the reason there's never a third game in the series is that this game didn't really recoup its costs, but... Don't know that for sure. We don't know... helpful dude to tell me to save my game which I sort of neglected to do let's save here cross over to whatever exciting boss battle is apparently coming oh it kind of dropped down a level that's neat ancient machine M vampire hunter D bow mod A bro A bro Cephas I bid you welcome, Ferris. Did you find the seals for us? <coughs> Ferris, Ferris. <coughs> Bejold. You people are evil too. <laughs> the good citizens of Andal worshipped and followed you like lambs of God. But because of you, Ferris, last time I checked, the lava and the flames appeared to be consuming those long ears. Kind of a dick. B Bozo? Poor thing, zoo. Everyone, zoo. Everyone's going to die in such pain. Zoo. You seem like kind of a, a bad person. Yes, you're dreadful. Zoo. Ferris is a murderer. Zoo. Dreadful guys like you ought to die quickly. Zoo. Belts? Yeah. It's the four fiends, except that they're identical. They don't have L ones. Yeah, I see that you have gathered them all, Ferris. Yes, you have collected all eight seals, Ferris, but you are still a pathetic wimp. Ma'am, the enemies in this game are jerks. They want people to die in pain, and they keep calling me names. They're calling me wimp. That one chick kept calling me, this is the, quote, beautiful snake chick, kept calling me ugly and stupid. I mean, had she stuck around in the game much longer, I was getting ready for her to start talking about how we have a tiny wang or something. You couldn't even help Bando, could you, Ferris? You couldn't even save yourself. So hand them over. Give, over, give me those seals right now. I'll leave my delay killing you until after the real great unions are concluded. I'm such a nice guy. Come on, give me the seals. Sure. Ha 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 ha. Don't lie, Ferris. You can't fool us. Yeah, well, then why did you ask? I thought you'd say that. Pick out a spot for your grave. Hey, it's the dickwads. Okay. So what do we want to do here? Probably should have switched my spells up so that I had Ferris using some more um, different kind of stuff. I'm going to kill him first. He's the biggest jerk. Should she cast some kind of, um... Yeah, these only affect one person at a time, so let's forget it for right now. Gubo! Take that, dickweed. Boo, yucka! Damn, that did a lot of damage. So far, these guys not impressing me much. That don't impress me much. Oh, oh, oh. Four fiends of douchiness. Battle. 
I was going to say this battle will get much easier once I kill one or two of them, but even with all four of them intact, they're not doing much damage. <coughs> Maybe they got some kind of group attack they're getting ready to use. Delta Force, only like quadruple force or something, you know what I'm saying? They do have different elements. Presumably they have different weaknesses, but... I mean, they have different elemental attacks they're doing. Oh no, you killed our dragon... thing. We better get another one out here. <laughs> Yeah, that's what you get for beating up our dragon. Presumably this dragon is helping somehow. Wow. That hurt. That hurt bad! Yeah, why the hell isn't she using Gubo, too? Gubo appears to be crushing them dead. Gubo, Gubo, Gubo. Is that the name of the animal? Is that the sound it makes? Oh, who cares? See, I figured he was the fire guy. He's got red robes on, but what do I know? Not much, apparently. Except how to defeat these guys. Boom! <sighs> hear that one, folks? Mad burn on those dudes. Alright, we got W2. But, oh no, they formed into... Um... Menasaur. No, it's Potente Petro. I thought we were going to have to fight another version of the boss. Grrr, you think you're pretty good, don't you, Ferris? Ferris, Ferris, calm down, will ya? You shouldn't strain yourself so much. Phew! Uh, anyway, here's Petro. Here's Petro! With tonight's top ten, he dies. Zoo, Petro dies. Zoo, is that fine with you? Zoo, oh Paris, you showed us the power of an authentic actor, Rigan. Actor, Rigan. Come on, game. Start, start explaining some of this stuff, would you? You are the Rigan of all Rigans, also called the Actor Rigan or the Life of the Earth Rigan. Is that an explanation for you, JG? Would you like me to spell it out any more? Hey, I'm impressed. Nevertheless, we still can't allow you to interfere with the real great union. So if you want to save Petro's life, hand over the seals. Uh, yeah. Ferris gave all the seals to Belts. Oh, Ferris. Thank you, thank you. Alright, what if you say no? Hey, Ferris, see for yourself. Petro is bleeding and will die if you keep this up. Quickly, turn over those seals before it's too late. Yeah, I figured. That's so silly. He's tossing him up and down with glee, I suppose. Oh, Ferris, thank you, thank you. With these, the real great union will be child's play. These seals have secured the real great union. Now we're off to Linus for the final touches. Meanwhile, you have served your purpose as far as we are concerned. You and your lackeys might as well remain here for the ending. Oh, cool, we get to see the ending. Yes, right here, ha ha ha. This would be like the you leave the kingdom ending and kill Jace. Hey, you don't get to take him with you, you jerks. So, can we, like, rush and stop one of them before he leaves, or we're just going to stand here and watch? This is like Golbez and his, his disembodied hand crawling after the crystal all over again. Oh, well, that sucked, guys. Sorry. That could have gone better. Medicine's flowing like the first medicine. Um, okay. I don't really know what this is about. This. Okay, more of an alarm. A strange mechanical voice seemed to come out of nowhere. ID system operative. Identification aborted. Defense systems are on. The voice began to sound more urgent. Moving pods head! Begin attack! Okay, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Um, I guess in the next video we're going to fight big machines, folks. Uh, let's real quick see what happens if I just... 
no, okay, I can't talk to them without doing this first. All right, folks, in the next video, Big Machines, directed by Michael Bay. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.